It's Monday morning, Glads. I'm Maddie Hager. And I'm Moose Santos, and this is your KWHS News. Here's the latest news from the Counseling Center. The college visit lineup continues in February with these schools. Pikes Peak Community College will be here on February 7th, followed by Fort Hay State on Tuesday, February 13th. Colorado Mesa will be here on Valentine's Day, and UCCS plans to be here on Thursday, February 15th. Plan your visit with Adams State Reps on Thursday, February 22nd, and then Lamar Community College will close out February visits on Friday, the 23rd. Seniors interested in attending PPCC in the fall, stop by the Counseling Center to sign up for PPCC's application day on Thursday, February 15, 2018. The PPCC reps will be here to help you fill out the application. They'll be back on Wednesday, April 11th to help you with the registration. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, cosmetology classes are coming to Whitefield next year. If you're interested, put your name on the list for more information by stopping by at the Counseling Center. Seniors, mark your calendars for the senior panoramic photo next week on Tuesday, February 6th at 7 a.m. in Bowers Gym. If you have haven't picked up your senior class shirt yet, those are still available in the Counseling Center for $15. Get yours today and wear it for the senior panoramic. And remember seniors, if you want your photos included in the yearbook or the senior slideshow, send them to Kiri Carmody at this email. Photos must be of seniors only. And finally, credit recovery registration is now open. If you dropped the ball and need to make up failed credits to graduate on time, Credit Recovery is for you. This is an online program where you can make up your credits in just eight weeks. There's a $100 tuition fee per course and you can take two courses per session. The spring session starts on February 12th, so you, you should get registered now. To register, go to the district programs page on the WSD3.org site, select High School Credit Recovery, and get started recovering those credits. There will be a mandatory orientation for credit recovery in the WHS cafeteria February 7th at 3.30 p.m. Coming up, we're checking in with Miss Betsy for the lunch mini for today and tomorrow. Happy Monday, everybody. Welcome back. Today we're having hot wings in the cafeteria, so come on down and see us, and tomorrow, pork enchiladas. So hope to see you then. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye-bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. Students, please add money to your account by going online or seeing Miss Betsy in the cafeteria. When we come back, we'll have club news, but first, we're throwing it to Daniel Robinson for a Gladiator Sports update. Happy Monday, Glads. I'm Daniel Robinson with your Gladiator Sports Update. Several spring sports are starting to shape up their teams, but if you miss the meetings, you might need some information before practices start. Mark these meetings and contacts on your calendar if you're interested in playing a spring sport. If you would like to join the boys' swim and dive team, check in with Miss Wickberg in room 110. For those ladies interested in playing soccer, see Mr. Dania in room 130. If you want to join the track team, check in with Coach Margerison in Bowers Gym for those details. For those football players not playing a spring sport, see Coach O for the off-season workout schedule. Those of you interested in playing baseball this spring, there is a meeting tonight in the WHS cafeteria at 7 p.m. Both players and parents are encouraged to attend. The forensics team was in Pueblo this weekend, and here are their results. Congratulations to all the team members who placed. Their next meet is this Friday and Saturday at Discovery Canyon campus. Congratulations to the NJROTC Corps of Cadets. They hosted their first ever drill meet and competed against some great schools. They showed some great skills and managed to win in a variety of categories. Well done! The wrestling team is headed to a tournament in Canyon City this Friday to spruce up some final touches before they head into regionals. If you can make it, go out and support our gladiated grapplers. In swimming news, the ladies raced against the Rampart Rams last Friday and turned in some respectable times. The ladies are also gearing up for their regional competitions this week, and they're looking good. In case you haven't heard, we have a basketball doubleheader this week on Wednesday against the Purple School. Our Lady Glads take the court at 6 p.m. and the boys play at 7.30 p.m. We want everyone to be there, so whatever plans you have, have, scrap them and join us as we rock Bowers Gym. Remember, it's a blue eyed game, so wear your best gladiator gear and bring your loud voices. Check out this video of TJ Davis's work against the Canyon City Tigers on Tuesday. Now tell me who could stop me. I'm in the zone. Competition's none in the league of my own. All about the double. If you can't make it on Wednesday, we'll have scores for you on Friday. But you know you want to see this live, and we want to see you on Wednesday. See you there. That's it for our sports update. Good luck to all our sports teams. Have a great week. I'm Daniel Robinson. Now back to you, Maddie and Moose. Thanks, Daniel.
Since we're in scheduling mode, there are several really great opportunities available next year. Here is some information for your consideration. First, KWHS News wants you. Applications are now available in room 102 if you would like to join our staff. See Mrs. Noob soon because applications are due this Friday, February 2nd. The yearbook also needs a few good staff members too. To join that crew, pick up an application from Mrs. Kennedy in room 104 ASAP. Those applications are due this Wednesday, January 31st. Staff Orange and Juniors, the teacher cadet applications are available in room 202 from Miss Ship. Time is running out, so get your application quickly. If you are interested in the STEP program for next year but missed the meeting on Friday, please see Mrs. Griggs in room 131 for more information. Renaissance applications are now available on the school wires page. Everyone is eligible to apply this time, including freshmen. All applications are due next Wednesday, February 7th to Ms. Sardinia in room 130, no later than 3 p.m. She will not take late applications, so be sure to check with her if you need more information. Just a reminder, Student Union is open again in the library every afternoon from 3 to 4.15. Be sure to have a sticker on your ID. Students and teachers, golden tickets are coming soon. Teachers, remember to hand out your golden ticket to that one student amongst all your students who deserves it. Students, if you're the lucky recipient of a golden ticket, remember to deposit it for a chance to win some very cool prizes. And finally, remember Glads, this Wednesday is a blue out day for the rival basketball game. Dress in your best gladiator gear, paint up your face, and then drop by to see Miss Melton in room 103 before 7th hour to enter a drawing for tickets to both games. Winners will be announced at the end of the day. Good luck. That's all for our news today. Have a great Monday. I'm Maddie Hager. And I'm Moose Santos, and this was your KWHS News. Have a great week. Mission.